congestion's worse even though there are fewer cars on the road, and that's because they've narrowed half the road so you can't get anywhere. I don't believe that government should make people's lives more difficult, and diesel is one of the real scandals of government policy of the last 20 years. As Camilla was saying, people were encouraged to buy diesels because of worries about carbon dioxide, ignoring the nitrous oxides and the particulates from diesel, which have killed people, have meant people have died younger than they should have done. This is a real scandal of public policy. And no, I don't think the answer is penalising the motorist. Most of us actually want to drive into cities, particularly if you represent a rural constituency like mine. People who want to go into Bath or Bristol, they want to drive in. It would take them all week to get a bus. They'd have to <laughs> dev devote their whole life to plotting the bus route. They want to drive in and out, and I think politics is about making life easier for people, allowing them to do what they want to do. 